OK. The first step, create a new project, in the CapCut application. Then add the video that you will edit. Remove this CapCut watermark first. Then add a song or music. For the music I use, you can download it, in the comments section below. Next, create beat marks on the music you've added. To do that, just go to the match cut menu. Then do what I do. Next, cut this video across all the sun beats you've marked. At this point, it's time for you, to edit the speed of this video, with the velocity technique. To do that, tap the second video layer on the timeline, and select the speed menu. Then, choose the curve option. And choose a custom curve type, so you can edit the speed of the video the way you want. Then tape edit. Here, there are 5 beat points, given by CapCut. Slide one of the beat points upwards to increase the speed of the video. For example, I'm going to increase the second beat point to be 9.9x faster. Slide one of the beat points downwards to make the video slow down. For example, I will decrease the fourth beat point to be 0.1x slower. Then, Tap the tick button to apply velocity video effects. OK. Do that for the third, fourth, fifth video layer, and so on until the last. The next step, we will give a flash effect, to each intersection of this video. To do this, open the overlay menu, tap add overlay. Then add a white background. You can get a white background, in the stock video. But, because my stock video has an error here, I will just add a plain white image. Place this white background, starting from the intersection of the second video. Then enlarge it like this. Tap this overlay layer. Open the splice menu. And choose the overlay option. OK. Now, you just have to copy this white flash effect to all intersections of the video. In this section, you can actually use a cap cut transition effect called white flash. 
You can watch previous videos on this channel. Ok next step. We will add two effects to this video. To do this, open the effects menu at the bottom. And select the basic effect category. For the first effect, find and select an effect called Edge Glow. Then extend the duration. Until the end of the video. Ok, for the second effect. Please find and add an effect called, Shake. However, place this effect. Starting at the intersection of the second video. And adjust the duration, to just like this. Next, you just have to copy this shake effect to all other video intersections. Ok done. And this is the result. Ok guys. That's the tutorial. How to make a velocity edit on CapCut Android with flash effect. I hope this video is useful. See you in the other upcoming CapCut video tutorials. And thanks for watching.